In this video, we're going to install the operating system and get the computer up and running. OK, let's power up the Raspberry Pi. The first thing your Raspberry Pi will do when it loads up is try to install the operating system. Now, the operating system is like a special program that controls all parts of the computer. So you might have used other operating systems like Microsoft Windows, Mac OS X or something like Android on phones. The operating system that we're going to be using today is a version of Linux called Raspbian. So it's already selected at the top. Just click install to install the operating system. This whole process will take about 10 minutes, so just allow it to do the work. And it's been installed successfully, so we say OK. And now it will take us to this software configuration screen. So what we want to do is, when we load up the Pi in the future, we want it to go straight to the desktop environment. So we can set that up here by going down to number three. Let's select it. And now we want to say, take us to the desktop login as user Pi. Okay. So now we can, no other changes to make. So we're going to go down to finish. Enter that. Would you like to reboot now? Yes. This time, when your Raspberry Pi loads up, it's going to run the Raspbian operating system. So you'll see the Raspberry Pi logo in the top left, and all these instructions start to appear on the screen. That's meant to happen. And there it is, your Raspberry Pi desktop. Now you'll notice it doesn't look that different from other computers you might have used before. We've got these icons along the side here, and a menu at the bottom left. Have a look about, see what you can find, and really start to get to know your Raspberry Pi.